like this car. Welcome back! Say it, dude. Hey guys, welcome back. Dave had a tooth pulled. Two, Two teeth pulled. Two Look at that fat gum. Hey. Look at that boy cheek swole. But anyway, this is what y'all been waiting for. The video of the race. Or somewhat. This is just getting, he's putting some AC on this bad boy. But Yeah, it's not race stuff, but you know, it's, it's needed stuff. Because I'm going to daily this thing. I love it. I love it. He loves it. He loves it. What? I love my Honda. Honda. He loves his Honda. I love my Honda. <laughs> but, race should take place very soon. Yeah, y'all see it by the end of this video. It's just a little bit of prep getting in there, you know. The clutch of mine's doing good. More Franks drove his EK. It's grabbing. It's not slipping as bad. So, we should be able to do some digs. Have a little bit of fun with that. Y'all ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. It's been like a three video get to the race. I don't know, we kind of changed, I changed cars in the middle of the race because he won the first race. The $400 Civic Challenge, he won. And now the cheap Civic Challenge. My race to win. So that means for all of you that think it's still the cheap Civic Challenge, what is it? What it's, was it? It's the cheap Civic Challenge now. It's not the $400 Civic Challenge. It's not the $400 Civic Challenge anymore because Dave entered Tanami Code with his game genie and bow turned the EK into an EG. I don't know how you do it, but he done it. Yeah. Damn it, Game Shark. Well, the funny thing is, Frank actually found this car. I said, bro, this one will be so much better than an EK. And I was like, I concur. So, look at that coupe. Uh, my favorite angle of coupe, bro. Look at this right here. This is my favorite angle on coupe. You ready? You ready? This is how all coupes should be seen. Huh. Beautiful. Putting AC. How many bolts be in this damn tank? <laughs> For the boss man calls wrenchified because you can't get a. And I got spoiled by the old electric ratchet. You can't put that in there. So guys, big news. We decided the loser of this race has got to sell their car. Or better yet, the losing car in this race, we're actually going to raffle off to a viewer. Now we're, you know, keep it real simple. Uh, $50 donation to the Build One More Foundation will get you one chance to uh, win and I'll show you the vehicles. We have Bow, this EG Coupe right here. It could be yours for $50, just $50. Now, hey, we are going to to 100 spots. Just 100 spots, it seems kind of high, but we'll cover shipping anywhere in the United States. If someone wants to win a car. I mean, neither one of them are perfect, but they're good little project cars, you know, so whoever for loses. For $50? Yeah. 50 bucks, we even fill the damn tank up with fuel before we send it to you. And guess what? The best part. This part, they both gonna have air conditioning. Yeah, AC. Or, like we showed you the EG, that you could win for $50 on an entry fee. I hope I don't lose, but if I do lose, you could win this. EK hatch. Which I hope I don't lose, but I ain't got no VTEC. So we, I might lose, man. Brought to you by. Frank, what you doing over there, boy? Well, April 5th, my boy bought me some window regulator for my birthday. And it's like July 20, what? First, I think. Third. Second, 21. That shows me how late. A few days left my birthday. July 23rd. It'll be 32, you guys. Talk to you. Oh, man. Well, anyway, as you can Still see. Still bumping here. Honda. <laughs> oh, Honda. We're going to be like, yeah, boy, that's 
I guess I'd worry that, dog. Hey, just wait for the sound effect I put in on that. Ah! It's gonna be the crowd gasp. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you guys. I got a jack. EK door panel. <laughs> yeah, Frank needs EK door panel. Is like that? bad. I got rot. Oh, <laughs> all the trash fell out. <laughs> hey, you guys. They were holding this. <laughs> Ain't nothing in it no more. Okay. All that stuff air was there. You used to pry up the window. We found all that down in the door frame. But I got the jack loaded up. I got the my Milwaukee loaded up. I'm gonna hey, change the wheels out when I get home. You saw them things you got in that box over there. What uh you see them cool lowers over or lower in spring, should I say? On some stress. My my friend Seth, the one I got the motor from, hooked me up on those. Um so I'm I'm excited. We're gonna just lower it down on those for the time being. That door's not shut all the way, it doesn't have a gap that bad. But uh, I'm gonna go home and get these wheels changed over. I'll show you guys that. Probably have Nolan helping me or filming or something. But uh, Frank's got his window working like it's supposed to. AC works on the EK. This right here. About to get some wheel change because it's giant tires. Thing sits like a Z71. Y'all see here in a few minutes. Yeah, I'm on the way home, guys. Just to think about things. I really like this car, which is crazy. You know, last year I had a Corvette. Had Supras and Skylines and things like that. Not bragging, I'm just I've driven a lot of crap, had a lot of pretty cool stuff. This little Civic right here, it just makes me happy. I don't know what a check engine line is, I haven't looked into that yet. Runs good, cross the VTA like it's supposed to. I got the radio working last night. I fell one speaker cover in the car. AC's going well, power steering is going well. I haven't had AC in a Civic. And an EG, except for once. And I had it in a, a hatch a friend of mine, Fernando owns now. I think he still has AC. That's been eight, nine years. Just cruising along. I like the sunroof. I don't like this stuff. Still have yet to figure out a solution to get that paint off, but I will. I kind of wanted to share a little bit of the ride home with you guys. Say how much I like the car. You know, I really appreciate y'all watching. To the new subscribers, you know, we, we do some cool stuff sometimes. You know, cars and coffees, and we go to the track from time to time. And, you know, do a lot of different builds. I know it seems like endless Honda content at the moment, which is what it's going to be because of what I got. That's what Frank has. So we get some mods for the old Zio. David gets back in town and we start building one of his trucks again. I think we got a 4080 to put in to the C10. I put the 60 in. Uh, yeah. Anyways, appreciate you guys. You're awesome. We're getting the merch stuff back up now. More shirts, maybe some hats. If you want some hats, let me know. Drop a comment. Um, yeah, we'll see what all we get. All right, guys. Here's the all black wheels. These are the ICWs that I had sitting in the house. There's Nolan, he's helping. Tires are a lot smaller, so I do got the lowering springs. They'll be going on it tomorrow, so it looks kind of goofy now. All the wheel gap, gap. but I got the uh, monster truck tires off. Hey, y'all see Nolan's new toy? What is that, Nolan? It's an Avenger, it's a BMS Avenger 150. It's, it's, like, a, it's like a Polaris 170 knockoff. Thing's awesome, it's like 32 with me and him on it. I'm a big boy. So we're going from a 20560 to a 20545. A lot less sidewall, but I don't know, you can just see the already the height difference in the car. It's a little down on the driver's side. All right, so I'm gonna keep going here and get the passenger side changed over. And of course, tomorrow it's gonna be a lot lower. It'll look a lot better. I got Nolan rolling the tires over there, sitting next to his old go kart. The apartment having stance like a Z71, guys, that looks better to me. We'll lower it tomorrow. Which should be Thursday, the 22nd. No one, you like it? You like it? 
No, the car. <laughs> yeah. Let's see, Nolan's little players. Chain driven, automatic, forward and reverse, neutral light. Yeah, he's got an alarm on it. That thing's sweet. Uh, we need to connect the battery before it starts. They gotta get some new battery terminals on there. It's not making a connection, but I had to rig up a tank up here. I like the black and orange wheels. Those look cool. This is Nolan's uh, first little, well, I guess it's his second little go-kart, but the yeah, first one actually worked really well. Suspension works like it's supposed to. He's excited about it. The girls like riding it. All right, next for this, we'll get it lowered and then maybe do some fog lights. So I got a set of the JDM fogs that come with it. But we'll see you out here in a little bit. I don't know what's going to be on the next clip. Enjoy this one. All right, Frank trying to get them uh, good shots. I appreciate it. I thought I just got on him for how he's using his own camera. Uh, it, it, damn it. Probably Matt, hold on. That's a little fresh That's All right, all right. So, in the spirit of Cheap Civic Challenge, we got some more Cheap Civic parts. <laughs> Used as shit. David, you done built this on a on a no budget, David. Hey. Okay, so we got some, um, got some lower springs from Seth, the same one I got the motor from. They've been sitting in the old garage, in the old garage. Let me see them. Give me a close-up on them. They're a little boys. rusty. I don't, uh -oh. I've never heard of that brand before, but y'all see the car? It sits like a Z71. I told y'all last night whenever I got the wheels on there, I was going to lower it today. Well, today's the next day. We're going to make this happen. They said gap. You're supposed to be gapping the comp, not this wheel gap. Look at this wheel gap. Yeah, I see with the smaller tires, I mean the front's bad, you put a whole fist in them. Not that anyone should be fisting their civics. Probably not good. Our, boy, you yeah. could, dang, boy. Yeah. So, we're gonna get these things right here loaded up. Just enjoy the time lapse of me doing this. It might be a long one, I don't know. Hadn't done uh, any kind of suspension stuff to a Civic in a while. I promise you I'll quit being cheap one day with it and start putting actual good money into it. This thing runs like a top. Brought to you by Honda. <laughs> powered by VTEC. The uh, actual goal for the car, and I said it from the moment that I got it, was a uh, uh, B-Series VTEC all-wheel drive turbo. And that's coming. You know, just enjoy the cheap footage for now. The whack parts, you know, the Amazon intake ebay headlights it's all gonna change it's all gonna get better y'all uh stay tuned enjoy this uh lowering of the civic are in i gotta bolt the brake lines back up <clears throat> forks went on pretty easy i'm kind of happy about that so i'm gonna get the wheels thrown back on and jump on this back side and um i might time that someday i might not and that was easy enough <laughs>
I'm all done. I pulled it out. Y'all seen the fronts and the rears? I resisted the urge to look back at it whenever I pulled out. We're gonna see this together come around the curve. Oh, yeah, that's so much better. All right, now that little mods and all that kind of stuff are done, Frank's car is ready. Y'all, the race is happening this weekend. Civic versus Civic. I like it. What do y'all think? Y'all stuck with me through this whole video. We appreciate it. You know, race video is coming. Uh, y'all like, share, and subscribe if you can. Check out the last video of us throwing this thing together. Um, yeah. See y'all next time.